What's up YouTube? Today we are bringing you a Shiny Star V booster box opening. I've been waiting to do this for so long and I'm super excited. So please leave a like on the video if you do enjoy it. Please feel free to subscribe to the channel to get notifications on my future videos. And without further ado, let's get these open. So let's start off with the first one. First we'll leave that here. We'll get this open first. Mine has been so long waiting for these. So glad that they're finally here. I can finally open them. Can't wait to see what we get. It's the first time seeing this set. Um, I've only actually seen this on um, YouTube videos and YouTubers opening it. Let's just take a quick look at the box as well that I've just opened. Um, it is pretty much the same artwork on the front as well. You've got the showcase of the shiny star Pokemon there. Um, you've got a Lapras, Charizard, Toxtricity, Scent Scorch, Ditto. Very cool set. Um, you've got Ditto, which is a new Pokemon in the set. Oh, the crimps are quite long on this as well. But yeah, we are opening our very first one. Oh, and you've got the Japanese back on there. And there's a code card, guys. So I believe this code card is for the Sword and Shield game. Um, you can type in the code there, you can just scan the QR code and you get a mystery gift with it. Um, and you get one of these Pokemon. That's uh, Marshadow, Vulcanian and Genesect. Um, and I don't think it's region locked as well or region specific, so you can get any of them. Um, so feel free to use that. I will be showing the code cards as I usually do in my videos. And I don't think there's any card trick with these. Um, they are reprints pretty much of the Sword and Shield sets running from base set um, all the way to um, <clears throat> Vivid Voltage. Oh, we've got a shiny straight away, guys. Check that out. Wow, it is a shiny carcle, and we've got a shiny straight away. Very nice. I mean, I'm not really surprised because, I mean, there are a lot of high pull rates in this set. Um, it says our first shiny. We've got a Suicune there, holo. Love the artwork on that. We've got a Casola. And our first VMAX, guys. It is a Crobat. What's behind it? It is... Oh, that's the river. Let's, let's get this Crobat first. So this is the Japanese version of the Crobat VMAX. A very cool card. There's actually a shiny version of this as well where the Crobat's pink. Um, but yes, our very first VMAX there, guys. And then we've actually got um, the new reverse foil here as well. As you can see, it's kind of got like a water rippling effect. I don't really know how I... It is quite cool. Don't know how I fit... Do I like that? I think, do you know what, I think I do prefer that to the current reverse hollows, but this is the new um, reverse holo foil uh, introducing the shiny star visa. It's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, very nice. So our first pack, we got a shiny Carcle and a Crobat VMAX, guys, and uh, the new reverse foils as well. So let's get these sleeved up quickly. I do apologize for going slow. Um, it is my first time checking this set out, so I'm very excited and I'm going to learn a lot of new things from this. But yeah, um, with each pack, guys, you do get guaranteed a V or a VMAX card or higher. Um, so that is really cool. We'll just pop that over there. So yeah, it is a high-class Japanese set. Um, so usually Japanese sets or Japanese packs have five cards in them, but this one you've got... Uh, 10 cards in them um, and you are guaranteed as I said a V or V Max card in each booster pack guys We've got Galarian Zigzagoon there, Swanner, uh, Evil Teapot, Galarian Obstagoon and a Amazing Rare Reshiram guys check that out there's only three Amazing Rares in this set it's Reshiram, Kyoga and I believe the other one's Veltil um but yeah, that's a very cool Amazing Rare card. The Amazing Rare cards did get debuted in the Vivid Voltage set. Um, and we have been opening them, but I really do like this Reshiram. It's such a cool fire Pokemon. And we have also got an Indeedy as the V card in this set. Very nice. And a Reverse Hollow Galarian Yamask as well, which looks really cool. Let's get these sleeved up. Beautiful. And you actually do get God Packs in this set as well as being confirmed. Um, a God Pack is essentially where every pack, sorry, every card from a pack does contain um, a, sh 
shiny card. Um, so they're all like secret rare cards. Uh, or ultra rare, secret, secret rare, super secret. I don't know what the classification for them is, but um, you can get a god pack that was confirmed. Um, the last time the god packs... Ooh, we've got a shiny snom there. There's another shiny card. Check that out. Wow, love the artwork on that. Very cool indeed. And then we've got Glissapod. There we go. Izama Zenta V card. And then we've got a reverse hollow there. But the two hits from this pack were the Zamazenta V card and the shiny Snom guys. I'm not really sure on what order they come at because, I mean, the shiny Snom came two cards before the Zamazenta V. Usually with the packs, there's a card trick and everything, but I believe there isn't a card trick. I mean, I suppose the reverse foil's at the back, so we could just take one from the back. Um and go from there. But yeah, you do get a God Pack. The God Packs were first introduced in the 2019 uh, Tag All Stars set. Um, and the rates of a God Pack are roughly about 1 in 600. Wow, quite, quite good packs in regards to like, they're not very flimsy. I mean, Champion's Path was so flimsy. I hated opening that set because they're just so flimsy. But these ones are really, really rigid. Um, so one to our, is this our third pack? There's there's a ball guy as well. Uh, we've got our beetle there. A Latian. Very cool hollow. I feel like that. Got a Galarian Surfetch. We've got a Crobat V. So this was, uh, this is a reprint of the Darkness of Blaze Crobat. Um, very popular in the TCG. And there's the reverse hollow card for that one. So that was our first pack where we didn't get a shiny. But I mean, so far... We have been getting, um, so out of three packs, we've got two shinies. I mean, that's not too bad at all. But yeah, very cool set. So happy to open it. It is actually my first Japanese set I have ever opened. Um, so this is all new for me as well. Let's so we take one from the back. So we'd go with the reverse hollow foil first. We're going to start off with a Sigilith, um, a Tedenis. That's a, a, a reprint. Dreadnought. And then there's our... Third, yeah, third shiny of the day is a, it's a Greedon, isn't it? Um, a Vault from the Squirrel, a very cool shiny, a very happy Greedon indeed. Just a squirrel looking for his peanuts, or his nuts. Um, and we've got a Hatcher in there, an amazing rare cat yoga as well in this pack, guys. So we've already got two of the three available amazing rares in this set. Wow, look at that cat yoga. Look at its teeth. I don't know how I feel about those teeth. Almost like Jaws from the James Bond movies, uh, but very nice. And then we've got our first shiny V card, guys. We have got a Bolton V shiny. So this is um, pretty much the same artwork from, I think it's the Rebel Clash set. The full art version of a Bolton V from the Rebel Clash set, where it's got like a blue background. Um, but it's the shiny version, um, and it looks so nice. It is actually one of my favorite shiny cards when I was initially looking at this set. Very cool. So in this pack, we got three hits. Wow, that was a very good pack. We got the Greed and Shiny, an amazing rare Kyoga, and a shiny Bolton as well. Wow. I mean, these packs are so cool to open because, I mean, you're pretty much guaranteed a hit in every pack. So you're already guaranteed as soon as you get, before you even open the booster box, you already know in that booster box, you are guaranteed 10 pulls. Um, because as I said before, you do get a V and a V max guaranteed in each booster pack. Very cool. I'm really happy with the pulls so far. I mean, we're getting a lot of shiny hits, um, a lot of pulls. I'm no idea what else we're going to get. Um, I'm hoping it's just going to get better and better. I really do want the Crobat V. I just think that's such a cool shiny. Um, and I'd love to get that. But we start off with the reverse hollow there. It is an Aracuda. I'm going through these coughing, guru key, run bike, and Rangaru, King Louis from the Jungle Book himself, Professor's Research, and a Rillaboom V guys, uh, sorry, a V Max. So, again, essentially a reprint from the Rebel Clash set. Let's get that sleeved up. I really do like the quality of these Japanese cards as well, they just feel so much better. I mean, I've never opened Japanese cards, but I mean, wow, they are amazing. I really do like these. I love the fact that they don't use yellow borders as well. Um, I just think it looks so much cooler. We'll 
take one from the back. Start off with a reverse hollow energy there. Toxel, a fossil, Akazolt, a Grim Snarl, and a Ditto for the V guys. Now, this is one of the newer cards. It wasn't in um, any of the Sword and Shield sets previously. So, this is a new V card. Very cool. There is also a shiny version of a Ditto in here as well. Uh, normal Ditto is usually purple, but the shiny version is blue. It looks so cool. Very happy to pull this one because it is a new one. It's not essentially a reprint. So happy with that. Let's keep going. There's a cord card for you beautiful people. I mean, it took me so long to get this and I've been so hyped for this set. And at the moment, it is not disappointing at all. I mean, we're getting shinies, we're getting amazing rares. Um, we got our first shiny... V, there's a Colossal there. Really love the Colossal Gold in the uh, Darkness Blaze set as well. It, has, it is one that I haven't got yet. And then we've got Center Scorch V in this pack. Very nice card. I believe it's shiny of that as well. And we're moving on to, I think it's the ninth pack. This is the ninth pack of the set. We've got plenty of hits as you can see. Um, and I didn't expect anything less really. Well, to be honest, I was kind of thinking that my look might not be that good. I don't know what my look's like um, in regards to other people's. I mean, let me know in the comments, guys, what sort of hits you've been getting. If you have managed to get your hands on one of these packs, I mean, it took me ages just to get this. Um, and there's the Rillaboom V. That is the hit. So the latter packs, our shiny look is running out. We haven't been getting many shinies in the latter packs, but the starting packs were absolutely amazing. And this is the last pack of the first booster box. Let's see what we get from this. Man, imagine if we got a god pack or something. That would be crazy. Imagine getting a god pack in my first ever Japanese Pokemon card booster box open. That would be so sick. So, Hadren, Yamask, Ducklet, Haunter, Heatran, Rillaboom, and a Center Scorch V Max, guys. Very nice card. I do like this card so much better as well than the actual um is it darkness blaze it's from yeah looks so much better than darkness blaze one and the cards just feel sorry that goes there the cards just feel much better as well um uh, much more rigid um in general right. and we'll get move on to our uh second booster box but yeah as i was saying in general the uh the print of the japanese cards is much more better than the uh, english prints um the printing is a lot more better centered and um, it is a lot more easier to get um, PSA 10 grades from a, a Japanese set. Purely because the print quality is just so much better when they do print these cards. Um, but yeah, yeah, I don't, I, I don't actually know what I would send a PSA 10 out of this set. I mean, well, obviously it'd be a Charizard um, if I was to send some to PSA out of it. Um, I don't know what else I could send. Probably just some cards that I really like. I mean, for example, if I did get a Ditto. Um, it is a very nice looking card. Probably send that just because I like the card. The Crobat Shiny V, if I got that, send that as well. Because uh, it's a lovely looking card. But apart from that, there's not a lot that I would probably send. Um, I'm not sure, I haven't really decided yet. But I mean, we'll see, we'll see what we'll get. Mr. Rhyme, Glaring Weezing, and there's another amazing rare, guys. This time it is another amazing rare Reshiram. I do like Reshiram as a Pokemon. Such a cool fire Pokemon. And we got a Phalanx for the V card, guys. Very cool. So as you can see, plenty of hits. Insane amount of hits. I've been doing a lot of Vivid Voltage videos lately. Um, and from a Vivid Voltage booster box, which is uh, 36 packs, we get about 10 hits on average. Most we've got is 13, um, and that's from 36 packs, um, and just alone from 11 packs already, as you can see, how many hits we've got, way more than we ever would get from a, a Vivid Booster, Vivid Booster, Vivid Booster, Vivid Voltage Booster box as an example, um, so you can just see, just goes to show um, how many good pulls you actually get from these bosses orders, love bosses orders, and then we got it, Satian. You know what, for a second there, I didn't know what that Pokemon 
was because I couldn't see the sword because it was blurred out. I'm like, where's the sword? Where's the sword? And, and it, it's there. Um, it was just me being blind, really. But yes, we got Isatian V as the guaranteed rare card from that pack. Um, but it took so long to get these, man. It took so long. The set release on, was it 20th? Was it 20th of November that it released in Japan? Or the 19th or the 20th? I can't remember. Um, and I've only just got them two days ago. Um, so as you can see, it, it took so long to get them. Been waiting for so long, patiently, um, whilst just watching other videos. Oh, yes, guys, we have got a Ditto V Max, guys. Another new card. So we've got a Ditto V now, and we've got a Ditto V Max as well. So in this particular card is the shiny version in this set as well. So it's essentially the same artwork, except Ditto will have stars showing um, that it's a shiny. Um, and the Ditto will be blue as well. Um, so that is a card that I do actually want because I really think it looks pretty cool. I'd love to pull that card. Um, but unfortunately, it's just a Ditto for now. But we'll take it because it is a new card introduced in the set. A new addition to our Japanese collection. So we'll definitely take that. We'll take one from the back. So we'll start with the reverse hollow foil first. And again, guys, it is that ripple effect. I do actually like that. I do prefer it to the current reverse hollow artwork as a ball guy. There we go, guys. That is our third amazing rare of the set of Um Only three amazing rares, and we have pulled them all already. It's very cool, very dark. Um, and we got a Dragapult V for the guaranteed V card. I've got to say, my best pack so far was that pack where I pulled, got three hits. We got um, the V, which was the Bolton V, shiny. Uh, the shiny Grievant, was it? And then we got uh, an amazing, was it an amazing rare Kyogre we got? So three hits from one pack was absolutely crazy. Wow. Um, but yeah, I'm really liking this set so far. We start with the reverse hoil there. Duckler. Energy, and there you go, guys. There is another shiny. Very nice. It's a shiny Cov Covasquire, I believe. Very nice. And as I said, um, I would normally expect like the rare cards to be clumped up at the back together, but they're not. It actually comes two cards before it. Um, so there's a shiny for that one. And then you've got a hollow there, another hollow, and then a Rillaboom V Max, which we have already pulled as. The, the guaranteed V slash V Max card from that pack. Let's get these sleeved up. I mean, it's so cool that you can get like a shiny um, and then the guaranteed V on top of it from one pack. It's just wow, absolutely crazy. There's a code card for you guys. Take one from the back, so we'll look at the. We've already got this one as well in reverse foil, haven't we? The Sigilith. Here we have Mr. Mime, Minchino, Tool Scrapper, uh, Toxtricity, very cool, love the border, Suicune, and another Ditto V, guys. So we're starting to get some duplicates now. We are starting to get some duplicates. But man, these, these packs are so cool, the cards are so cool. I mean... First time opening a Japanese set and I'm very impressed. Absolutely amazing. I mean, it's completely different opening them than actually just watching a video. You get a feel of the cards, um, the actual quality of them. Absolutely amazing. I mean, if you guys haven't got any already, I definitely do recommend trying to get your hands on one. And they're a bit more expensive now than they were when you were initially pre-ordering them. Yes, guys, there's another shiny. It is a Galarian. Is it a Galarian Stunfisk? Yeah, it is Galarian. Very cool card indeed. So there's our shiny and then... We've still got the V Max ago, so we've got Copper Raja as a hollow, got Apple Turn and oh, <laughs> oh, oh my god, we've pulled, <laughs> we have pulled a shiny Charizard V Max in our very first Japanese booster box opening, our very first shiny star V set of packs that we've got and we've pulled. A shiny Charizard V Max. Wow, did not think that was going to happen. Oh, and the card is just amazing as well. So as I said, it is essentially the same artwork. Charizard's position the same way. 
the normal VMAX version was in the darkness of blaze, and then you got the rainbow version, the champion's path, and then the shiny star, the shiny version has been debuted in the shiny star V set, and this is such a beautiful card. I mean, look at that. I cannot believe we've just pulled that. Wow. <laughs> Wow, 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 wow. And the centering is really good as well. I did say that the quality of the Japanese packs are really, really good. I mean, look at the centering on that. Very nice. But wow, I can't believe we've just pulled Shadi Charizard VMAX. It's pretty much like a lot of people's main chase card um, in this set. Wow. <laughs> wow, I cannot believe that has happened. I mean, my look's not always great, but today is very, very good. I mean, this has to make up for all the Vivid Voltage Booster Box I've been opening, try and get a Chunky Chew. To you guys who are new to the channel, I still haven't got a Chunky Chew and I've opened about 15 Booster Boxes, but this definitely makes up for it. Wow, check that out. Our first Shiny Star V opening and we get the Charizard V Max. Absolutely over the moon with that. Wow, <laughs> can't believe that just happened. And we've still got a couple of um, packs left to go as well. Wow, check that out. Um, I mean, another uh, a high value card. Another, another, another high value card in this set is actually the uh, Marnie um, trainer card. Um, it's pretty high value, surprisingly. Um, I mean, it's not a card that really appeals to me. I do like this card, actually. I do like Clefable. Um, I have always liked this card from the set. I think the artwork is just amazing on it. And then another set of Scorch Fee, which we already have. You also get the um, my favourite promo from the Sword and Shield set in here as well. It is the um, the Gengar promo, um, the Gengar from the Champions Path Stone Side Collection box. So um, it's essentially a gym collection box, and it has Matt Champ and Gengar as a promo. But I do I've got tons of this reverse foil as well. Um, Scalarian, you know, say, um, Sigilith. But yeah, the Gengar promo. I really love that Cinderace. I do like Cinderace Pokemon. Station and a Rillaboom V guys. Wow. Such a cool box opening. Really impressed with these cards guys. Um, I got mine from uh, a website called Plaza Japan. Um, if you guys are wondering where I got my boxes from. It did take a very long time mind you. Um, but I didn't get any custom charge. Uh, sorry, I did get some custom charges as well on top of it as well. So just make sure if you guys are ordering. Um, I mean, I'm from the UK, so um, I'm speaking on behalf of um, the UK viewers. But if you do get some, ooh, check that out, guys. We got a Thwacky there. Check it out, a shiny Thwacky. Um, another shiny there. Um, very nice. But uh, yeah, you you uh, you will be have to pay a customs charge on top of it as well and a center scorch v max as the final card but yeah you will have to pay a customs charge if you do order um from plaza japan i am speaking from experience here guys um so don't think that it's just oh yeah i just have to pay the 60 70 pounds or whatever it was for the box and that's it it's not um you will get a customs charge from uh well, before the item is delivered to you. Just gonna quickly show the Charizard VMAX. I mean, look how many pulls we got. Wow, that's from 20 packs as well. That is crazy. Um, such a cool set opening, but look at that. That is the highlight of this video. Wow, I cannot believe we pulled that. Fantastic. Check that out. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please demolish the like button just for this card. Um, and just let me know what sort of, you know, pulls you guys get if you do. Um, Get your hands on some of these boxes and um, please feel free to subscribe to the channel i do post as much as i can wow this card is so cool but yeah guys that's it from me i will have another shiny star v box soon i'm still waiting for that um, and when i do get it, i will open that but for now that is me over and out guys i will see you in the next video